Open Clip Art's a wonderful resource for those of us who don't have um, a lot of artistic talents. I can look for clip art to use in my classroom. Uh, and you can see there's some stuff already organized by for teachers. I'm going to look for something that's uh, representing the learner profile and looking for something unbalanced. And uh, if I look here, you can see you know, there's some, some good stuff there, but nothing that really would be very helpful. So maybe I'll search for something else. And I've done a search for an umbrella. I'm thinking maybe I could get a tightrope walker. If I look through there, there's all kinds of umbrellas. And oh, look, here's somebody who's obviously a better artist than me. Shu has an, a panda carrying an umbrella. So if I go and, and open that up, uh, I, those, I'll see that. And there's a wonderful uh, panda. He's perfect for, for walking a tightrope. So um, I'm going to download this. And I can download the SVG file and then open it up in Inkscape. So I'm going to go over and do that. So I've already opened that up. Here it is in Inkscape. And I'm not going to, for the purposes of this, I'm not going to show all the different changes in editing. You can, you know, use the tools in Inkscape to change this. Uh, but I've already done that. You can see I've, I've used a line and drawn a tool for show him walking on a tightrope and made a couple of poles and all that. Uh, and I've saved this as called a tightrope walker. Uh, and I think that'll be very useful for well balance. So let me go over here, and here's my umbrella handle, and I like it very much. I've, I've already favorited it, so it's always a good idea to kind of tell people you like what you're reloading, what you're using. And I'm going to upload the remix. You could upload it uh, as plain, but since I'm remixing his, I'm going to, or hers, I'm going to upload it there. I'll click and browse my file, and there's my tightrope walker. And I'll give it a name. And I might as well call it Tightrope Walker. And the keywords is uh, important to put in as many things as, as makes sense because um, that will be how people can search for it. So I'm going to call it Tightrope, Umbrella, Panda, um, Balanced, and Well Balanced, and maybe Learner Profile. Under Description, you can give any kind of thing. I can say I remixed the Panda and added a tightrope. And this is where I can put in my username, um, which is fine for giving credit that uh, it's a show that it's a remix of the original Panda. And here you can tell whether if you are doing things that are not safe for work, but this is definitely is. And I can click Submit. And then when I've uploaded it, it's added successfully. Now people can search for my file uh, and it's uh, registered as a remix of the original Panda. And that's how you can remix somebody else's work in uh, Open Clip Art and Inkscape.